Hey everybody, how's it going? I wanted to do a one month update on this Saint Franco solid gold chain from Saints Gold Jewelry. And this is a 2.5 millimeter chain sitting at 16 inches. This pendant on it is from Hawaii Rope Chains, but I have never really taken this off my neck unless I'm doing other jewelry videos and trying to showcase different pieces of jewelry in front of the camera. And there's probably been one to two days that I just decided to wear sterling silver just to kind of change it up. But right after that, I throw this back on with my usual three millimeter rope chain from Jacoji, And I just love the way they look together. Now, there's really been no complaints that I have had with this chain. I'm going to show you what it looks like up close, but it is two toned, So it has white gold and yellow gold. Let me show you what it looks like behind the camera just get it off my neck real fast okay here we go here we go and then it's slipping on here it is okay get a bit closer here so this isn't like your typical boxy sort of franco if you're a fan of like rounder chains i think you're gonna like this one if you like the boxy look of the franco i don't really see this being something you might want to look into but i will say this catches light so nicely. It really is a gorgeous chain. It slipped out of my hands there for a second. But let me kind of show you what the end clasp looks like. I do wish that it was a um, like a teardrop shape, but I'm not really going to complain about it. I'm very, very happy with it. Um, it it's gorgeous. Super, super gorgeous. Let me just, if it's going to stay, oh, it's not focusing. not sure you could see it there but yeah i really really do love this chain i have gotten so many compliments on it already this is just something that really does catch the eye it's sort of like one of those subtle flex chains you know what i mean it's not something that is designed like the flat links where it has like a very intricate sort of design but there's just something about its presence that you know, kind of ask, like makes people ask, hey, like, where'd you get that from? What is that? I like your chain. I like your jewelry. So yes, this is something that I have been wearing very comfortably. I mean, I sleep with it, shower with it, been in pools, beaches, jacuzzis, worked out in it, all that sort of stuff. And I really don't plan to take it off my neck unless another chain kind of comes around and becomes my new daily wear. But like I said, I have been two chaining it every single day and i'm going to continue to do updated videos for you just so you could see what these pieces look like through heavy use you know i understand that some people like to just wear their jewelry when they go to special events but for me i really want to see how well these hold up and how they look years down the road you know because these are things that i want to pass down for generations so i want to make sure of course that the quality is there but i think the only thing i might have to worry about is that with prism cut chains like this Saint Franco, I'm not really sure when the time comes, if I really need it to be cleaned, I might have to send it back to the company and maybe they'll do like a repolishing or something because I believe there is rhodium over the white gold. I might be mistaken with that, but I think that's the case. Now for me, I really haven't cleaned these chains like in the way that most people kind of I don't know, like with like certain solutions and things like that. Like I said, I just shower with them and they still look amazing. So that's kind of been the way I have been cleaning them. And as you could see from my background here, I do talk about fragrances as well. So not only have these chains been in different sort of environments, but I do apply a fragrance like usually on a daily basis. So you're kind of seeing what these chains look like with that into play as well. You know what I mean? So even when I'm spraying fragrances, there's no discoloration, but I really don't think you should be seeing any sort of discoloration if you have a solid piece. And if I didn't mention earlier, these are 14 karat gold, all right? So anyways, I'll continue to update you on this chain. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Bye.